BMW has unveiled a concept version of an electric car designed for extreme desert driving. The prototype was called Dune Taxi, and its author was one of BMW's designers. The experimental electric car looks like a race car for the Dakar Rally, and BMW also revealed some characteristics of the car. It is known that the body is made of polymer reinforced with natural fiber, and a power plant with two electric motors develops 536 horsepower. Acceleration to 100 km per hour will take 4.5 seconds. And BMW's signature features can be traced in the front of the car, including large nostrils of the radiator grille and LED optics. The car has a reinforced suspension with huge ground clearance and large off-road wheels. At the same time, it is not reported for what purposes except directly PR campaign this car will be used. A curious specimen from the United States, which can not only drive through mud and snow, but also swim. According to the manufacturer, the Mud Ox XL is a real snow and swamp vehicle. The all-terrain vehicle has the following characteristics. Four-wheel drive, 57 horsepower engine, speed up to 40 km per hour on land, and up to 5 km per hour on water. Payload is up to 900 kg on land, and up to 450 kg on water. Moreover, the model can be reinforced with caterpillars and get even more cross-country ability. For confidence on any route, they added a rollover protection system, seat belts, and a steering assistance system. The gas tank has a capacity of 45 liters. This is enough to drive 10 hours without any problems. The all-terrain vehicle costs about $45,000. Americans never cease to amaze. The U.S. company Terramac, which specializes in the production of crawler chassis and dump trucks on their bases, introduced the latest model with the Index RT14R Terramac. The main feature of this machine is fully rotatable platform, which allows the top of the truck to turn 360 degrees around its axis. Characteristics of this dump truck are impressive. The vehicle has a payload of 12.7 tons, and its design allows to unload the material at any angle even while driving. The RT14R weighs 18.1 tons and is equipped with Cummins QSL 9.0 diesel engine with output of 320 horsepower. The maximum speed is 10 km per hour. To reduce ground pressure, the machine uses new rubber tracks. Considering that the truck will need to work in difficult conditions and in difficult terrain, its cabin is protected according to rollover protection structure ROPS, and falling object protective structures BOPS, standards. Canada is famous for its heavy snowfalls, so the transport that we will talk about now is a severe necessity for many specialists, from pipeline repair experts to firefighters. The presented track all-terrain vehicle Alltrack AT20 HD has a payload of 1.5 tons, as well as a 74-horsepower turbodiesel engine. The maximum speed of the all-terrain vehicle is 22 km per hour. The cabin is a two-seat, and the rear part is sharpened for equipment such as drilling machines, snow removal systems, plows, and more. Unfortunately, there is no information on the price of this all-terrain vehicle at the moment, but if you make a request, the developers will provide you with the details. India also does not stand still. As part of the government program, by March 24, 2022, more than 23,200,000 permanent residential buildings have been built. The main building materials were wood, cement, concrete, and bricks. In front of you is the mobile brick-making machine. Even the simplest model makes up to 6,000 bricks per hour, and upgraded versions make 12,000 bricks per hour. In order to work with this installation, a team of three to four people is needed. It takes four days to fill it with bricks the size of two football fields. What do you think about mobile brick-making machine? Share your opinion in the comments. The problem of any racetrack is braking, overtaking, and other maneuvers, as well as small defects after races. To prepare for a new day of racing helps German series traffic lines. It's so good that it's even used in some airports. Bands of Formula One can often see these amazing machines in between races. The track is cleaned using a powerful water jet. Thanks to this, the surface dries quickly and is not damaged. A working width of up to 4 meters makes it possible to work as quickly as possible. And the patented suction system saves time and money. The all-terrain vehicle called Hamster with a mono track, designed by Edward Luzanen, first assembled in 2020 for the all-terrain vehicle trophy. 
The model with a funny name hamster and a price tag of about $3,500 turned out to be very popular, even taking into account the fact that engineers work only by pre-order. The all-terrain vehicle model gained its popularity for a reason. It combines compactness, cross-country ability, and ease of operation. Initially, the Rover was introduced with a single track, but many people began to wonder how to turn on it. That is why the next version of the hamster has two caterpillars. The all-terrain vehicle turns almost like a tank. The fuel reserve of the cross-country vehicle is 10 liters in the tank and 5 liters in a reserve canister. The fuel consumption is about 1 liter per hour. Recently, a crazy version of the Toyota Tundra was put up for auction in the United States. A pickup truck capable of surviving a zombie apocalypse. The auction was held on the Bring a Trailer site, and the final bid was $40,000. The seriously modified 2013 pickup truck drove 77,248 kilometers, and the previous owner spent thousands of dollars on its completion. Tundra got new lighting, improved suspension, 20-inch wheels, and a 174-liter fuel tank. The Craftsman also installed new bumpers, a winch, a special trunk, a loudspeaker and other improvements. The front brakes were also replaced. The pickup is powered by a 5.7-liter V8 engine, which is combined with a six-band automatic transmission and all-wheel drive system. The experts also installed new bumpers. This compact and turbo-diesel all-terrain vehicle, known as the Kreshet Z210, originates from Russia. The all-terrain vehicle can accommodate up to seven people. The combination of fully independent suspension, 60 centimeters of ground clearance, and a 100-horsepower engine allows acceleration up to 50 kilometers per hour on land and up to 4 kilometers per hour on water. The fuel reserve is 200 liters, consumption from 15 to 40 liters per 100 kilometers. The vehicle is ready to work at temperatures from minus 60 to plus 50 degrees Celsius. The big advantage of Kreshet is the ease of repair. The developers promise that 80% of the components are available in auto stores. The all-terrain vehicle will take about 45 days to assemble and will cost about $100,000. A 50-horsepower four-stroke engine, 450 kilograms of payload, and a continuously variable transmission make the Compact Tracker 800SX an incredibly good off-road vehicle. However, this was not enough for these skillful fellows from the USA, and they decided to modernize Tracker 800SX in their own way. They upgraded the vehicle to the maximum. They replaced the wheels with caterpillars and added a cap with a glass windshield and special wipers, as well as a heater. Engineers did not specify how much money they spent on improvement, but the base version of the off-road vehicle starts from $17,000. Write in the comments which of these vehicles you like the most. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also watch our previous videos. Goodbye.